average American will flush $11,198 worth of toilet paper mm-hmm. over the course of their lifetime. $11,198. You have flushed down the toilets, my friends. Yeah, that's a lot to flush down the toilet. It's not cheap. Well, it's expensive for you because you buy the fancy schmancy you stuff. You have I mean, to. Life is too short not to buy the fancy schmancy stuff. Now we get the sandpaper. You can't buy the sandpaper. Just Why spend not? The extra I love the sand. Are you kidding? If you think that fancy schmancy stuff takes anything off of you, yeah, I'm telling you, it doesn't take anything off of you. You got to use. I the sand feel paper. much better now. Look, I'm bleeding. <laughs> uh, but I'm also clean as opposed to whatever's going on uh, down there with you. No, you got to buy the fancy stuff. I mean, that's it's two ply. It the, the bears like it. <laughs> <laughs> he, the cartoon bears seem to really enjoy it so no you, you gotta buy the soft stuff you, you can't no, they've buy conned the cheap you, stuff my friend they have conned you into thinking that something with aloe should be cleaning your butt it should not be cleaning <laughs> your butt should be cleaning your butt no no i'm, I'm doing serious business in there i want a serious toilet paper i want actual sandpaper frankly i mean i want it just just tear off whatever's going on down there tear it off no i think everybody should have a bidet <gasps> you know it's so funny you would say that my friends my two, my best friends who just moved to la mm-hmm. they have a bidet they had one here in new york and they've been waiting for it to be shipped that's all they've been waiting for they love their bidet they, they can't mm. get enough of it well think about this when you drive your car through mud or let's say your bicycle okay. so you, you ride because <laughs> you don't have a car you ride your bicycle through mud uh-huh. and then you go get a paper towel and you try to wipe it off it really doesn't right. come off true but if you spray it off with water it will get clean I don't know that a bidet works that hard. It's not like a fire hose. I think it's, I think I think it's it more is. like a, I think it's more like a drinking fountain. Well, why don't you just use a baby wipe? You know, I had a boyfriend who said to me when I first started dating him, we had this conversation. He said, "If you're not using a baby wipe, you're not as clean as you think you are." Uh, well, you with the sandpaper and no baby wipe—that's got to be a nightmare. Are you kidding? It's for me. It's a whole project. I'm practically like a doctor in there, like surgery. I've got the sandpaper. I've got the baby wipe. You know, I'm I'm examining everything, making sure that I'm totally clean. You got the mirror out, standing on your head, trying to see. Yeah, that looks good. Um, with a listen, bit- I'll tell you. I'll, let me tell you why else the sandpaper is better than your stupid aloe bear toilet paper. Yes, as a woman, I will tell you, your stupid bear toilet paper. How do I put this nicely? Um, doesn't fully come off after you use it. There's always a little remnants or, or two with the sandpaper. There's no remnants. It's just gone. No, there is not. You, you don't feel that strongly <laughs> against sandpaper, toilet paper. You're just cheap. That's what it comes down to. You're just going to go find the cheapest one there is, and that's what you buy. No, I want to be clean, <laughs> and it happens to be the cheapest. That's just that's just a bonus. So $11,000 down the toilet every your whole lifetime? Yeah, once it's a year. about 180 bucks a year. But you know what? That, it's got to be okay. It's got to be twice as much for women because we use twice as much because mm-hmm. we have two places. Right. And also, um, it also depends on how expensive your toilet paper is because, like you just said, mine's really cheap and yours is really expensive. And it matters, I think, how long you're at work. <laughs> if you're at work 14 right. hours a day, you're not using that much at home. That's true. But if you're at work at home, then like some people, then you're going to use more. No, I think right now during the pandemic, probably everyone's using more toilet paper at home. Got to be. Right. Well, and there's really no difference between the toilet paper you use and the paper towel in the bathroom. It's just, it, I don't know how the you do it. The paper towel is softer. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. <laughs>